I'm Glory Palachek, and this is my husband, Jim. And I'm a psychologist by profession, and my husband was an attorney for many years. Our backgrounds were such that we loved um, the humanities and arts. And that's how we met, and that's how we started. About 10 years ago, we started painting at home and just found that it was such a great release for us. And it gave us such joy that we've continued. So together, we've painted about 100 paintings. Anybody who is in the process of trying to express what's inside them is creating art in that process. And for me, when I get involved in doing a painting, I can lose myself in trying to create something that I see as being beautiful or has, have a vision for creating this particular set of colors and designs. It's, uh, it's something that I think I have to do because it, it, it is something that my soul wants me to do. The attempt to create beauty outside yourself is something, I think, inborn in people. Even though we're not good at, maybe we're not good at the craft uh, of it, the, the actual technique and the skill, but you kind of know what makes you happy and when you look at something that resonates with you. The process of figuring out what you want to paint is, a, is really important, and Glory is excellent at that. Over the years, I've seen her visualize something that she sees. It's either going to be a, from a, a master that we've seen in a museum in the Prado in, in Madrid or in the British Gallery in, in London or the National Gallery in DC or some other gallery we visit around the world and it's something that strikes you say that is such a great piece of art you want to try to duplicate that. So the first part is really left brain. What I'm, I'm trying to figure this out but once you get involved in actually doing the painting itself it's totally right brain and you lose yourself. And when we paint, I, I think we, we find that. Just being there at the moment, is, it's a, that's a great thing. That's a beautiful thing. I think everybody should be able to experience that. And I think we're awed by the universe. So expressing that awe is a way of giving back. I don't know, is a way of expressing your gratitude to the universe? Maybe it's just all that simple.